last August, uh, I took a redundancy and took time out of work. And um, literally within days, I sent away for the clipper um, uh, brochure. And Amri just happened to be traveling through from the US. And I had all of the clipper stuff out on the, on the kitchen table. I knew uh, that I was a bit nervous because I had never raced before. And uh, Micah's like, but it's for amateurs. Like, uh, anyone can do it. We waited to crew allocation to know where we would be assigned and if we were going to be on the same boat or different. And uh, actually quite uh, exciting. We were on different boats, so we were able to um, race each other. So uh, for me, uh, that... Not competitive, right? Not competitive. Uh, Anne-Marie pipped us at the post at... Uh, <laughs> so and actually, as we came into Punta, uh, Hotel Plano were, were in the bay, and then Liverpool came in right behind us. So, so it couldn't have been any closer. But anne got family on it, so she, she's, <laughs> she's got the pennant for, for leg one. So fortunately, on leg two, we just about kind of got ahead of uh, Hotel Planner. So we're on as even. What happened for us is during the race, you know, we were a bit behind, but um, I was able to watch them and it changed from we got to get them, because I know that that wasn't possible, is they've got to get podium. Michael, Michael deserves it. So that was a change of spirit, but kind of how we roll. Uh, and it's one of the things I really like about it is everybody's really supportive of everybody else, no matter what boat you're on. Um, but it is it is really nice when you come into port, into Punta del Este, having spent 35 days or 33 days at sea, to see a friendly face. Uh, uh, and similarly, when you come into Cape Town, you know, if you see somebody who you really know well or whatever, and they're just there to see you in, that makes a big difference.